Hello and thank you so much for all of your questions which have been flooding through on social media. There have been loads from first time buyers and I'm determined to answer as many as I can. If I don't get to your one in this clip, please don't give up, do subscribe uh, and it should be in the next one. Um, Gail, I think this is a really interesting situation um, and it's a good situation for all involved. You've been able to effectively try before you buy. You've lived in the house, you know the area, you know the foibles, you know what you're getting into. Um, the, uh, the landlord will be able to collect rent right up until the day that you complete the purchase. So that's good news for them. If you are renting it privately, the landlord would also not have to pay an estate agent's fee. There's a lot to go at. Um, definitely worth exploring. Do approach the landlord directly and see if you can motivate a conversation. Uh, if you rent it via an agent, um, then it's probably better if you have that conversation via the agency to start with. Good luck. Well, Mark, fortunately, you are absolutely right. We do a number of deals that are off market. Um, how does that happen? Well, contacts with agents and, and real on the ground research uh, is paramount. There's a fair bit of luck involved, but there is also more proactive things that, um, that we do and, and indeed anybody can do. Letter drops is, is the obvious one. If you are focused about where you want to live and in what streets you want to live, then write letters and pop them through people's doors explaining who you are, why you're interested in that house or that street and you know, make, it pers make it personal, make it polite. But if somebody is just on the cusp, thinking in the back of their mind that actually they might put the house on the market or they might even put the house on the market next year, they get a letter like that, um, it can prompt a phone call. And of course that person, if they sold the house to you, wouldn't incur an estate agent fee. So there is benefit to them and obviously there's a big upside for you. So try everything. It's worth it. You never know. Good luck. Well, it's not unsafe. I think it can be a great scheme. What I would say is that you must read the small print and really understand what you're getting into. It doesn't suit everybody, but it suits some people brilliantly. Um, it is quite complicated, so I'm going to pop a link underneath to an article that I've written that should explain everything that you, um, you need to have a think about.